question for Star Master Lee is, what motivate you to keep going with anime? Okay, well, uh, my answer will be long for, uh, my answer will be long for this question. I can tell you this, there were two parts of my uh, anime life. During the first part of my anime, it was a product, especially uh, Hemohim. Hemohim was the most important reason that I opened my mind uh, to anime. And I trusted him because of my personal experience. So my product trust kept me going at the beginning. That is why uh, anyone who wants to add me must have a product trust because it is the fundamental driving force for especially beginners to move forward to the next level. And then uh, the life scenario was my uh, another driving force for myself. Not only did I write a life scenario, but also I told my family about my life scenario, like what uh, my dreams were and what I would buy for my wife, like her dream car or house, right? And as our CEO said, if we proclaim our dream to family, or people near, near us, then the life scenario will be not only a promise to ourselves, but also uh, to family or people. Therefore, the promise will keep us keep uh, going no matter what. I can tell you this, he was absolutely right because the life scenario, the promise to my family motivated me to move forward. For example, my wife asked me time to time what happened to her uh, dream car or house. Not because she uh, believed Adomy, but because she wanted to prove that I was wrong about Adomy. And her uh, doubt and trust gave me some kind of a strong motivation, uh, determination for my uh, dreams. It's like, okay, I will prove it. I will show you who is right. And I will... We will see about that. That kinds of a spirit that I got from her distrust and the doubt. So at the end of each year, I said to myself, let's do it one more year. And when next year came, I said it again, just one more year and one more year. That's how, that's how I did for my first part of anatomy. And however, the biggest turning point in my anatomy life was four to five years after I studied anatomy, which was my second part of anatomy life. So what happened was I started to have internal bleeding. My hemoglobin level was four. It was a very serious condition. It's like life and death situation. And internal bleeding kept happening for next three years. Although I got blood transfusion, I lost my blood again and the hemoglobin level was back to five. So it kept happening for the next three years. Even one time I fainted during my work. So I couldn't go to work. So no work, no income. And I didn't have any income to support my family. So biggest question that bothered me a lot at the time was who will take care of my family, my wife, and my two little boys, right? But Adomi kept sending me a check every week, even though I didn't work. That was the power of a residual income. I realized at the time, I realized that Adomi would take care of my family if I was not with my family. That was the main reason why I had to do Adomi. I found my own why, because Adomi is my only and the last option for my family. Because of my personal experience, I always emphasize on this why question to people. Because we will face many unexpected problems, even we will rejection from people during this Adam journey. But if we have our own why, that will be our energy. That will be our energy and reasons and driving force to keep us moving forward. So I hope that you also find your why for your own anatomy 
then you won't give up. It will motivate you keep moving forward. Like the enemy, my own why kept me going forward. So that's my answer to your question. Thank you for the great answer. I will find what are my why to continue enemy again. And I really appreciate for your time. Thank you.